Hello, this is Alekius, and welcome back to Rule the Waves 2 as France in 1929, where we've been at war with Germany for quite a while. We just had a major fleet battle up in the North Sea, and uh, it went very well for us. The, we sunk most of the German capital fleet, and they are hurting now. I'm going to look to see what is left. Alright, they still have a Prince Idol Frederick and another Prusen. So that's one dangerous ship and one not so dangerous ship. But she lost her other Prince Idol Frederick. I think we sank one last time. No, we sank the Mackinson. That's what it was. Okay, we found out a little bit more about the Austrian planes. Don't really care. Blockade is hurting Germany again, so that's more unrest for them to deal with. Thank an AMC. Swept a minefield, and we're losing submarines at a steady rate now. Oh, some destroyer action, and they accept it. Oh, it's under their air cover. Less than ideal. Let's see what they have. Three destroyers. Is that it? Just as night falls. We got the first hit in, which is normally the case. I got the second one though. That's a misidentification on their Obervasa. Getting some more five inch hits. comes the rest of the destroyers. We take out just this one, I'm happy with that. It is August, so there should be a decent amount of nighttime. But I think at 2000 we're going to turn around. Please slow down. Yeah, we're not seeing anything. We'll head on back and we'll get this. Oh, there we go. Tally ho. Keep maneuvering around. Not that I think that's going to protect us overly well. There we go. Knocked out a second destroyer. And look at that, I think we found some more. Hopefully a Corvette this time, but I think that's a lie.
and there's another one down. And there's another one. Oh wait, that one's the one that's already sinking. Ooh, the Husser got took a full broadside. Get them to go home. Actually, let's get the Ariary to go as well. We'll be directly commanding only one. That's fine. We're pretty much done with all of this at this point. The battle is almost done. And B-28's done, and we're looking at 2100 hours. Come back around for another pass. Not getting hit notifications though, so I think that one's pretty much done. Let's go. 20 knots. Another destroyer because it could hurt us. A Corvette Stella class. Now done. Keep running into all sorts of ships out here. This is a highly successful raid. Dropped cruising speed, we're got plenty of night time left and we should be at port shortly after dawn. And no losses and we took out three destroyers and two corvettes. Marginal victory, my foot. That was a great success. Yeah, we heavily outnumber them. Without border changes? Absolutely not. That's right. Large territories. Take the last of the German colonies. And then, since it's peacetime, let's take a look at rebuilding some stuff. We'll get that advanced director in there. Well, even the turrets are poorly armored. I don't fit a plane, could I? Nope. Not unless I stripped something. And those 6 inch actually do, do something. Get the better 14 inch guns. Want the tertiaries, don't want to give those up. Suppose I can bulge them. I don't want to lose that speed though.
Let's see, who else is going to come up for refit soon? To our raiders. This will put them out of commission for a while, but it'll be cheaper per month. We just adjust that. No AA though. Oh, we'll bulge them. Give us a little tonnage to work with. We can even subtract gun size to five. I kind of want to keep them at sixes though. But we can, what we can do, give a secondary director and put other guns on there. Do they have air seaplanes? They do. Here, have a hanger for that seaplane. Max mines. Anything else to change? Throw some tertiaries on there, and I think we're good. That would even be a cheap, quick refit. Because we're back at the ammo limit that we had before. Get rid of that. Lose one, a pair of the three inch. Ooh, I don't have a catapult. Uh, Q usually works. But that's taken. Go to the R, and that's right on that funnel. What? And that did not put us over. Okay. Very well then. Oh, we can get rid of the submerged torpedo tubes. And instead, Center line, we want FG. That's a little bit heavy. That'll do. No director for secondaries. That's fine. We can get by without it. Clear to all issues. All right. Rebuild those. I am ready to just scrap these. They are old.
Same with the arcs. Our pawns are not bad, but uh, I think I'm done with them too. And really, the monthly balance? What are we spending it on? Mostly construction. I suppose that's true. Go ahead and halt. And halt. Do the rest of them. Motor torpedo boats, hooray! Our base to all has. To all is out in the middle of nowhere. Cameroon. Do we want airplanes out there? Or do we care about the colonies? I don't think so. Tripoli we care about. Probably Tripoli, Tobruk, even Benghazi. Like, I, I don't mind lessing up fortifications out here. What do we got? We have Libya, or Tripoli, and Spalato. Okay, perfect. Oh, those are air airship bases. Get rid of those. Airships are sold last year. Let's see about... We want an air base. Yeah, Dalmatia, Spalato, Zara, Taro. I think Spalato works. Build another one. Airbase, Lindos. That'll be Rhodes. Windows is further south. Eh, we'll just do roads. It's fine. Then let's do Libya. Do Tobruk. Libya, Tripoli, Tunisia, Tunis, then that's a bit far, but we'll do Maris El Kabir. And we'll do Marseille and let's say Olbia. Let's see, Corsica, Sardinia. So once further north, 
Corsica is north. Sardinia is the southern one. Olbia. And then southern France. Marseille. That gives us a lot of overlapping coverage in southern France. Or, I mean, Mediterranean. I kind of want to do Cherbourg as well. Get some more overlapping coverage out here. Not that the channel sees much combat. And I do want to build a mortar torpedo boat. Squadron in Dalmatia. Only takes six months though, so we'll do that if we come to war with Italy. We just built a whole bunch of air bases in the Mediterranean. We have three in the North Sea and eight in the Mediterranean now. A little bit overkill. I'm fine with it though. Really, Germany's high tension again already? Or medium tension? It, medium bombers aren't a new type, we already have them. Hey, K guns! I know it over exceeds. Plan on expanding it. They're not that expensive, 40 a month. That'll be 440 once we get them all built. It's significant, but it's not insurmountable. construction on the destroyers that'll buy us a couple months for the battleships to finish their refit less signaling errors thank goodness improved torpedoes motor landing craft now build bigger air bases we'll wait All the Mediterranean bases are now built. Secondary director, sure. Can I do this as a batch? I don't even remember. No. There we go. Cost a few dollars. Japanese want better machinery, sure. Lower risk of landing accidents. New medium bombers. Torville has finished. No tall. Add medium bomber go. Gain is finished. Aliens want an inclined belt, sure. Less weight. Now have a positive. Get those destroyers finished. Will has finished. And so have all of these air bases. 
Oh, copy air group. Paste. 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 And one last. Paste. There. Now I have aircraft in all of them. More time, we'll pump that up to 60 aircraft per airfield. We'll wait for now, though. What is the most likely enemy for future? Let's see. Britain is scary, especially if we don't build more submarine. Goes the US. Also, especially if we don't build more submarines. How many carriers do they each have? One and two. Plenty of light carriers. Go to war with Germany again. I do have a good chance of getting East Prussia. Especially if I force a... A capitulation, a revolt, and actually reach them outside of that. Hmm, they don't have any colonies. Italy, we might be able to do an invasion of Sicily. That, and I've just made a huge thing out of the Mediterranean. Not interested in Japanese colonies. British are going to be everywhere. Really? Germany or the US? Depends on if I want an easy fight or I want an uphill battle the whole way. Let's do the US. Is what it is. Well, that puts it even. We'll see how it pans out. Get the next battle cruiser going. Yes, please. On that. Oh, sure, yes, I'll purchase. Wait, savings on machinery. Pause that now. Or AA. Really? Oh, jeez. Battleships are so expensive. that and how am I going to I'll just get these going again okay killing me prime minister killing me putting out a local yard size we really need to start investing in our dock size that. Delete that extra turret. And dual purpose 6 inch. 6 inch are useful. Do I have 15s? I do. I have high quality 15s at that. Minimum 150. I don't want any light A. Dual purpose 3 inch secondaries, or tertiaries, I should say. E plane hangar with two airplanes, central line launcher. And this is way heavier than what I can handle. We'll drop down to the 14s again. I think I can do the all forward mounts. is maximum. 
Let's increase guns. More air directors, please. Drop the secondary AA battery to 3 inch. Secondaries are not protected from splinters. Turret top of 5. Okay, I can see why. All or nothing. That makes them have almost no immunity zone. There's no way I'm going to get that much. Do I do something crazy and do like a magazine box? I'm going to take a bunch of flotation damage. Go the extra cost, do the inclined belt. More likely to hit the deck. Needle defense is two. Do I do something more armored or do I just keep it fast? Now well, I can get a couple hundred tons if I switch back to or an aft armament. Smaller secondary battery. Maybe go down to fives. I like the sixes for being able to hit at other things, but do we really need them? Push them to singles. We don't have dual purpose fives though. Dual fives. Just a few. Then we'll pepper the decks with threes. That leaves us couple hundred tons. Lose the hangar. Which sucks for the seaplanes, but I don't really care. Do HI, just triples. A hundred tons there. And gives us a ring indicator. Can we do it for battleships? Yeah, I thought we could. I remember getting that technology. See about four and a half. That's too much. We can do a little bit more pelt. We can't really do more deck. What about speed? That's pretty close. Okay. I think that's a ship. I mean, it doesn't have much of an immunity zone, but it has armor. More than our previous one. Two less, gun, less guns. Sizable 5 inch battery. Has some torpedoes, not too many. I hate to not be using all the AA positions, but that's what it is. Okay, I like it. Let's do it. There's the Nantes. Take four months to develop that. I think this will be another longer episode. So I will keep going for a little bit longer. Fascist coup has taken place in Germany. Okay. We're gonna refight World War II.
more machinery weight savings. Yeah, that decided me. Step up, oh, exports. Yes, absolutely. I need all the budget I can get, thanks to the Prime Minister. Design study is two more months. More funding. Reduced engine horsepower requirements, of course. Right as I'm building a new battle cruiser. Let's go to the build screen. We'll build two of these. Just because I like to have them in pairs. And we'll resume production on these two. Dive bombers! We'll give them an angry letter. Quest, new dive bomber. I want range and bomb load. Low plane scout is the only one with decent reliability. Might have to go back and request a bunch of new ones. I haven't been doing much. There we go, we, we meet the standard. All of our agents caught in the US, don't mind escalating. We'll halt. Nope, not those two. These two. They're gonna take forever. Zoom that one. Loose comes out. Yeah, the Austrians can have some tech. Better submarines. Dunkirk being finished. Italians want better machinery. I'm okay with that. Better rate of fire. I would love to have 2,000 ton destroyers. Get some of our light cruisers completed. Yep, I'm perfectly fine with that. More AP. Well, the Austrians really lagging behind in machinery. Maybe I was just really far ahead. Got our 11 inch guns. Aliens want machinery too. Apparently I'm just ahead on machinery. Ah, dive bomber prototypes. Range is important, so is bomb load. Maneuverability, toughness, firepower. Yep, I'm gonna go with the lower. And then... Request a new... Fighter. We want reliability secondary. And then with a new fighter, we probably want maneuverability or firepower. We'll go with we'll go with maneuverability. Yay! Heavy destroyers. I'm 
various tech. Ooh, private venture dive bomber. What does it look like? More maneuverable, tougher. Uh, the range looks kind of short, if I remember the other one. So I'm going to say no. It's fast though. I'll give them that. British dive bombers carry 250. Kilogram bombs, that's not much. Austria wants better submarines. Sure, they're good allies. Yes, I would love to extend it. Oh, apparently I didn't have the all forward armament. Now I do. Better armor quality. We saved up enough money. Let's get these, the rest of these going. Ooh, quality one sixteen inch. They want better hull designs. New fighter prototypes. All have great range. All have great maneuverability. That one doesn't have enough toughness. Fast. I'll take the maneuverable one. We'll go all in on maneuverability. Aircraft type wise, we have a new fighter. We have a dive bomber at last. Let's get a new. Medium bomber. Oh, I don't have a torpedo bomber. Well, medium bomber, we're going to want. Bomb load and range. Austrians wanting more tech. Better fleet logistics. Lightweight scantlings. Yes, please. More ships being can commissioned. Somebody's got to be getting close to being obsolete. Wow, some of our destroyers are actually. Do a straight rebuild. Do we need to add anything? I don't think so. Do a straight. Oh, wow, we have. We have directors for the destroyers now. Low, low cost of all of their anti-aircraft. We'll give them a medium gun. A 20 millimeter and we'll call it an upgrade. All 15 please. Corvettes too, they need to stay. Yeah, I don't care about their fire control. Just rebuild them. Uh, 
Oklahoma, the U.S. caught one of our heroes. I mean spies. German seaplane carrier. Yeah, whatever. Better ASW. Wow, we might actually go to war with the U.S. Australia wants better AP. They want to give us a better medium bomber. Dive bomber. Much better speed, a little bit better range. Sure. Ashiku in Japan. Lightweight fittings from the British. Er. New medium bombers. Lighter bomb load. Longer range. Much longer range. And better speed. Lighter bomb load, but it can carry it to medium range now. Okay, yeah, I'm fine with that. That's pretty good, actually. Now the flying boats and the float planes we've been neglecting. Let's look at the flying boat first. We want range above all and reliability. Yay, more money. Can I guarantee a victory over the U.S.? No, but I'll take the prestige. Naples diesel engines, outstanding. Yeah, we're going to war with the U.S. Without a doubt. Hmm, where's my submarine construction program looking like lately? but we need as many as we can get. Any ships I can start sacrificing because their cost is too much. Where is that gap in coverage? Not West Africa, not the Indian Ocean, Northeast Asia. Get you up to Northeast Asia. There we go. Okay, we're not ready, but we're as close as we're going to get. May lose these light cruisers here shortly, too. Oh well, say la vie. With that, I'm going to save here. We're way over now. And um, thank you for staying to the end. Please leave a comment, let me know what you think. And I will see you next time. Take care.